Hey everyone, welcome back to Tracy's BTS Unboxing. I'm Tracy. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. And we're going to get into today's unboxing. Surprise, surprise, it's proof. What? But we'll actually get started with this. <laughs> and this is the BTS Dynamite, Dynamite Scarf. Now this was on Weavers, but then Weavers did that collaboration with Nordstrom's here in the U.S., and so this is the scarf. It just says Dynamite on it, BTS. And on the other side, it says 2020. And then on the back side, it, says, it reads, you sent us to the top, which they're referring to the Billboard Awards. So this was on the, Nor the reason I'm telling you about this is because on the Nordstrom's website here in the U.S., Everything is 20 to 30 to 50 percent off. So Nordstrom's was $62 and I got it for $27. And it is official BTS merchandise. So these were on the Weavers website for about $62 or so. And then Weavers, big hit, hype, collaborated with Nordstrom's and They've had it on sale for about six months now, and now they've started barking down all the merchandise. So everything, t-shirts, hats, sweatshirts, is all anywhere from 20 to 50% off. Like I said, this was originally 62. I paid 27 for it. And then if you use a Nordstrom's card, I think you get an additional 10% off. So, and it's not only Nordstrom's, Weavers also, Big Hit Hive, also partnered with PacSun here in the U.S. And on their website, everything is about, also about 20 to 50% off. They also have several shirts that are buy one, get the second shirt 50% off. It's shirts, hats, just all the merchandise on, their webs on the PacSun website. And also the other U.S. company, Zumais or Zamira. Sorry, I can't even remember how to say their name. But they also have BTS merchandise, though most of the merchandise is the McDonald's stuff. And all of that is also on sale. Most of it's 20 to 40% off or somewhere in that area. So I would check it out if you want some clearance stuff. They only ship in the U.S. for some reason. I don't know why, so... But there we go. So good deals there. So we'll start with proof. I'm going to go through this really quick. Just because I think everybody has seen the unboxings. So we'll go ahead and get started. I got this last week, but I didn't have time at the, at the time to film it. So I did go ahead and look at my cards because, you know, I'm impatient. <laughs> so, uh, so there we go. I got Jen for the photo card for the uh, postcard, and then I pulled J Hope. I was very happy about that. And then this here is just the anthology of all their CD. Well, kind of like the photo anthology of all their CDs. And then on the back has the same. So that's actually something very, it's kind of neat. And then this is just a poster. It's a very small mini poster. And then there's their legs. There's nothing on the back, it's just white. CDs. I have to say with this CDs, this um, packaging, it's almost like, it's very smooth. I mean, it feels almost waterproof, like a wax paper. And then this is just the track list there. It's a very interesting texture to it. And then this is just a little photo book lyrics I'm very much feeling J-Hope lately
And then these are the lyrics for CD2. And then CD3. And then we'll do proof. All right, so this is the other uh, CD or packaging. It's heavy. I know everybody has talked about how heavy it is, but it is. It truly is very, very heavy. We'll go ahead and start with the photo cards since they're on top. Oh. And this is just the envelope, simple. And I got Jim in for the photo card or for the uh, postcard. And as you can see on top, <laughs> I pulled Jen. And this was the special card or the random card. And then these are black on the back, and then the uh, special card is white. So, All right. And these, I'll just go through really quick since I'm sure you've seen these by now. But oh, my neighbor is drilling something. And these are a lot of the photos that have been going on. I'm sure you've seen on the internet or your Twitter, Instagram. It's a very cool concept. What is that, a safe? Yeah. Hmm. And this just says beyond the scene. Which kind of cracked me up because uh, I could have swore I saw an interview that Arm said that BTS does not stand for Beyond the Scene. But there it is. <laughs> so. And then I know on the Nordstrom's website they also call BTS Beyond the Scene as well. So I'm not quite sure what to make of that. And this just lists all of their albums. Kind of the concepts at the time or photos at the time. I know a lot of people were surprised by the news that came out this past week, but I can't say I didn't see it coming. I thought we would be getting solo albums. I kept Everybody kept wondering when it was going to be. I'm glad it's going to be full-length albums, but then I just thought, I'm going to have to buy seven more albums. I mean, I don't have to, but I'm going to buy seven more albums. And I wonder what kind of music they're each going to put out. I'm really looking forward to... Uh, J-Hope's 
kind of think he might do something totally different than what he's done before. So we'll have to wait and see, of course. What does it have to say? Dynamite. Oh, that butter hair. I love it. But, and I know that JK or Jungkook has a, um, a song with Charlie Puth. Oh, these are all the tours that they had. So we're looking forward to that. I think that's next week. What's today, 19th? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I've had a little bit of a weird week. I took a vacation day at work. Forgot I took it and clocked in. And went, yeah, I work from home, so I clocked in. And my manager messaged me. She's like, why are, why are you clocked in? I'm like, I'm working today. And she's like, no, you requested it off. I'm like, oh, yeah. <laughs> and that threw my whole day off, my whole week off. So, oh, yeah, that's my life. <laughs> oh. All right, so what you guys think of the yet to come song I like it it makes me sad now that you kind of know the news um, behind it it kind of makes me sad but it is a beautiful song I do think JK hitting those high notes at the end man that's something else I mean you know I go for that every time but you know it doesn't happen and it was just a track list and this is that same waxy type paper I mean this is glossy um, metallic but this is that same waxy type paper. Like almost feels waterproof. I don't know why. And this is just lyrics it looks like. The lyrics are all in Korean. Though there's a lot of translations for the English lyrics on there. On Twitter and on, um, on YouTube as well. So... These are just a lot of behind the scene photos over the years. Or them looking at their old photos beyond over the years. Oh look, that crown kind of means reminds me of Game of Thorns. No. Yes. Maybe. And then this here is just the poster. Just one more. So this is the poster. Let me try to do a little close up. It is quite large. It's probably three and a half foot by two and a half, maybe. I hate that it has the crease in it, but at least it's not over any of their faces. All right, everybody, that is it. And I'll see you in the next video. I don't know when, but go ahead and hit like and subscribe. And I'll leave a link to another video you can watch after this. Have a great day. Have a beautiful Sunday. Peace.